Today, Michael Cummins, the man accused of the deadliest mass murder in Tennessee history, appeared in a Sumner County courtroom. He's accused of murdering eight people in Westmoreland back in 2019, including his parents and a 12 year old child. The trial will not start until next year, but the court is trying to determine how many trials will happen. News horse Marissa Sulik was in the courtroom today and explains why separate trials could benefit Cummins. Michael Cummins is accused of killing eight people at three different crime scenes on different days. Defense argues that all of these three crime scenes should be tried separately to reduce any prejudice. The state says they should be tried as one because they're all connected. Today, as Michael Cummins walked into a Sumner County courtroom in handcuffs and shackles, TBI and Sumner County investigators took the stand recalling three different crime scenes they responded to in April of 2019. Three crime scenes the defense wants tried separately. You can't get a fair trial on Dunn or Furley if your court allows in the six uh, homicides from Hosell as well as the other Furley and or Dunn trial in the trial of, of each of those cases. All of these crimes were committed to cover up a theft. But the state argues a car and gun Cummins is accused of stealing connects the scenes. We're talking about in a close proximity of time, Judge, and they're all committed in the same violent manner. And how all eight victims died is another similarity. Prosecutors say they died by blunt force trauma to the head and some sharp force trauma. And they are brutal. I'm not going to hide. That's why I ask these to be placed under seal today because of the brutality that these victims suffered. TBI Special Agent Miranda Gaddis also testified shoe prints found at one scene match another. Your Honor, that is part of the story that has to be told. And we're allowed to tell that full story. In the end, the defense says there's no evidence Cummins' intentions were part of a bigger plan. Because these cases are not connected to common scheme or plan or signature crimes, anything along those lines, uh, the court has to sever these into three different cases. Now the judge will decide whether there will be three trials or one next month at the motions hearing. Reporting in Gallatin, I'm Marissa Sulek, News 4 Nashville.